four hours left. Can you um, tell us what the... Um, well, we went to a restaurant for our lunch. Oh, by the way, it's uh, local time, 1.39 p.m. And we just left... What's the name of the town? Narandra. Okay, Narandra. And uh, it's a small town. And um, we went to this... Um, Chinese restaurant and the um, well the white owner or attendant mentioned something interesting can you tell us Steven? no you can okay well the attendant told us that uh, we have to be careful because the town is uh, full of racist people and I asked them, or I asked her, uh, against what? And she said that the town is, uh, well, the powerful people are the aboriginals. That's what she said. And, um, and yeah, if you don't stand up against them, um, um, something, I guess something bad will happen to you if you don't stand up against them. Yeah, I think she said, don't take your wallet or something. Oh, yeah. Well, I, I admit that, um, that they, that that town really has a very high, uh, concentration of Aboriginals and, uh, and uh, well, not all of them are full-blooded Aboriginals. Some of them are half Aboriginals. What I've noticed. Well, it's interesting. Maybe we'll learn more about that town eventually, because uh, that's just one person's opinion. Okay, and we're we've been on the road for 11 hours. We've got four hours left. And we're heading towards Wagga Wagga. Wagga Wagga. And that will take us how long? Uh, this one should only be about an hour and a half, two hours. Well, an hour and a half. It's only 90 kilometers. 